four out of five Americans are dehydrated. And when you're dehydrated, that literally means that your body does not have enough fluids to perform its normal functions. Even if you are on a perfect diet, your fat loss will stop right dead in its tracks if you don't drink enough water. It's also a really easy way for you to get inflamed. Inflammation is usually the precursor to many ailments. In other words, you have to drink enough water. With that said, what is enough water? It's easy to think that your pee should be clear. That is actually not the case. When you drink water, your pee should be slightly yellow. If your pee is clear, then that means that you are probably drinking too much water. And when you drink too much water, you might be flushing away minerals and electrolytes before they are able to get absorbed by your body. So if your pee is slightly yellow, then that's good. A good way to start is to just shoot for a gallon a day, two slash three of these a day. Now, quick tips for you to accomplish this. One, when you wake up, drink eight sips of water because after you wake up or the minute you wake up, you just went without water and food for seven, eight, nine hours. You are dehydrated when you wake up. Secondly, if your goal is to hit a gallon a day, for instance, and hit half of that amount before noon, then it's going to be easy for you to hit your remainder for the rest of the day. The third tip is for you to aim to be done with your water about two hours before you go to bed. This way your body will get rid of all the fluids so that it is less likely that you have to get up in the morning and break your sleep pattern or break your sleep cycles for you to use the restroom. Tip number four, if you want to make your water taste better, I highly recommend getting some amino acids. It's basically pre-digested protein powder. So if you eat a piece of chicken breast, it's mostly protein. If you eat eggs, it's all protein. It goes down in your stomach and your body has to digest it, pull it all apart, send all the nutrients to where they need to be. With amino acids, it's basically all digested already. So what happens is if you put this in your water and you drink it, it goes down your system and it gets sent straight to the muscle. Now some say that it prevents muscle loss. Studies have shown that it does and other studies have shown that it doesn't. I take aminos with the background that even if it's just a placebo effect and if it doesn't work it still makes my water taste good i also use it during my workout so i'll take my pre-workout before my workout and then when my workout starts i'll start sipping on the aminos and then if i'm just doing cardio i'll drink that while doing cardio as well so hope this helps guys let's not over complicate this you just have to drink enough water and this is one of the most basic fundamentals of building a healthy lifestyle you just got to do it all right there's absolutely no excuse you have to get this done. So get half of your goal water in before noon and you'll be good.